InShot has been updated. Now you can use light transitions in all of your videos. Here's how. I love Mike's videos. Please subscribe to his channel for more tips, tricks, and tutorials. To use light transitions, tap the video icon. Transitions are only available if you're using the iOS version. Once the clip loads, you'll see that I have white circles in between each of my photos. These circles represent transitions. To choose a transition, just tap on one of the white circles. You can choose individual transitions, or you can add one transition between all of your video clips. To use the light transitions, you have to have a copy of InShot Pro. If you don't, you'll only be able to use the basic transitions. Swipe down and select one of the light transitions by tapping on it. To choose another transition, tap a second circle and then choose the transition you want to use. Once again, you'll see what the transition will look like before you use it. When you're done, tap the check mark on the right. If you'd like to apply one transition to all of your video clips, select another circle, tap on it. Once you do, choose the light transition that you want to use. Instead of tapping the check mark on the right, I'm going to tap the double check mark in the left hand corner. This will apply one transition to all of my video clips. I like that one. So I'll tap apply to all. And once you see done, that transition has been applied to all of your video clips. If you're happy with the video once it finishes, tap on the export icon, also called the share icon in iOS. As usual, don't close out of the app or switch between screens while the video is processing. If you do, the video will not process properly and you'll have to do it again. Once processing is finished, you can find the completed video inside your camera roll. Let's take a look at all the light transitions.